ANSYS Simulation Solutions supports sustainability in many ways, from emission controls to recycling, alternative energy development, and more energy efficient manufacturing. In order to organize these solutions, we established four sustainability pillars, clean environment, materials and circularity, energy solutions, and manufacturing and operational efficiencies. Simulation enables companies to save resources, energies, and emissions throughout the development product lifecycle. Many of our customers are using ANSYS simulation products and services to create products and processes that have lower environmental impact. Simulation improves the speed at which environmental innovators can develop, mature and deploy new technologies. ANSYS sustainability solutions are used across industries, including critical sectors uh, such as energy, automotive, aerospace and defense, high-tech and industrial equipment. At ANSYS, uh, the FSCs have a very important role in progressing towards our sustainability goals and reducing greenhouse gas effects. There are lots of examples in our existing EMEA portfolio. In Weimar, we are recycling the heat from our server room. In Otterfing, we are using solar panels. Very importantly, in Madrid, our new office was designed for LEED certification and reached LEED Gold certification for interior design and construction. When we talk about sustainability on the offices, it is quite important to check where the furniture and materials are coming from, with a preference for engaging local suppliers. We also continue to encourage sustainable practices within our own operations and in those of our suppliers. For example, when possible, we select electricity providers which have a high percentage of electricity coming from renewable sources. In EMEA, we are focusing on improving the facilities that support our employees who ride their bikes to work. And finally, we continue to conduct energy audits at select sites to ensure we operate as sustainable as possible by focusing on LED upgrades, motion sensors, and upgrades to heating and cooling systems 